Holocaust survivor, Elie Wiesel, he said, we must always take sides. Neutrality helps the oppressor, never the victim. German Protestant theologian Dietrich Bonhoeffer, he said, silence in the face of evil is evil itself. And he stood up for the rights of human beings in his time that were oppressed by the Nazi regime. Instead, I think that evil is often the byproduct of misguided empathy or the result of silence. So it's important for us to speak up, to know a few arguments, to be able to ask some serious questions in, in order to bring others to the truth of this topic. I don't really think that people in the abortion industry wake up each morning thinking, how can I hurt women, dads, children? In fact, I've spoken with people in the abortion industry and they often claim that they're trying to help people. Many of them are victims of the effects of abortion themselves. And so I argue we must treat them with utmost respect, but we still have to be bold proclaimers of the truth, and we have to celebrate life in all of its stages. So this is a heavy topic. You might ask yourself, well, what can I do? Not everyone can travel with 200 high school students per year to Washington, D.C., for the March for Life. I say celebrate life. Encourage love and support those who are expecting a child, even if it's a difficult situation. Because let's face it, if a woman is pregnant, the baby's already here. And so we need to support both children and moms and support dads. We gotta support them all. You could help someone Maybe you're, you're the first person that someone tells that they're pregnant and you could connect them with pregnancy help centers all over this country. 